answer to this. What were you thinking? <laughs> My lady, please. She was? Yes, for you escort her in, but you had nothing to do with the altercation. Please, Lady Marjorie. Please don't send me back to Highgarden. Finally, you grace us with your presence. I was beginning to think you'd found someone else to serve. Sorry if I kept you waiting. I came as quickly as I could, my lady. I'll get to you in a moment. Do you realize how precarious my position is with Cersei? Of course, my lady. Of all the people in King's Landing, you steal from the Queen Regent. I didn't mean... Did you know about this? Sarah's been stealing wine. From Cersei, no less. As if I haven't got enough to worry about. No, my lady. It doesn't sound like something Sarah would do. Is that so? I had no idea. Really? Half the servants in the keep are talking about it, but somehow you're in the dark? <sighs> I'm sorry. I shouldn't get so flustered. It's just... I need order in my household. Until I'm married to Tommen, I can't afford any more mistakes. I have no choice but to make changes among my handmaidens. Tommen's garden party, Mira. What were you thinking? I can't believe you'd be so irresponsible. I expected better of you. It was a foolish mistake, Lady Marjorie. We shouldn't have disobeyed you. At least you're honest about it. Sarah's been saying some damning things about you, Mira. I suspect in an effort to save her own neck. My lady, please! You've said enough. One of you must answer for this. Sarah says you used her to get you into the party. You've been with me a long time, Mira. When I'm queen, I'll need people I can count on. Please, tell me this isn't true. Mira, please. I can't go back to Highgarden. You promised me you'd take the blame for this. Is Sarah telling the truth or not? My lady, I... I'm sorry. Sarah's telling the truth. This has been building for some time, Mira, but it still breaks my heart. I've been nothing but good to you. I've put up with your schemes. I've even tried to help you and your family where I could. And you repay me with this. I feel... betrayed. I won't have it. You'd have done the same in my position. Don't tell me what I would or would not do. Consider yourself dismissed from my service. But, but, but my lady... Get out! Mira, wait! I'm so sorry. She was so angry. I, I didn't know what else to do. You saved me from being sent home. I can't believe you did that for me. I expected I'd be on my way to High Garden by now. But you stood up for me. You're my friend, Sarah. I look after the people I care about. Thank you, Mira. I really mean it. I know you don't have to. I wish things had turned out differently. But I suppose this is goodbye. I'm not sure when. I'm not sure we'll see each other again. You need to learn to be a better liar if you want to survive. 
King's Landing is no place for the good-hearted, Sarah. That may be you, but it's not me. Then you should think about getting out as soon as you can. There's something I need to tell you. Something I heard. There are some vile rumors going on about you. Rumors? About you murdering a Lannister guard. I thought you should know. Thanks, Sarah. Careful, Mira. You're on your own now. They're nearly on us. Half a league or less. You were right, my lord. I know that snot-nosed bastard Griff. He was sent to kill me, not Roderick. He wouldn't run home to his father without trying again. Listen close! I want the road surrounded. Ride hard for Ironrath. Don't turn back. If this goes to hell, they'll need to know about Roderick. Yeah! Lay low and be ready to strike the moment I give the order. And what order is that, Asher? Pain the road with their blood! Seven hells! Take them! Kill the Spawnistars! No grip. Oh, he's a bloody coward. Mm. Yeah, your brother was the coward. You should have seen him squeal. Oh, when Griff gutted him like a pig. <laughs> My lord. We're going to kill them all for this. Roderick. I wish I had known him, Asher. I'll never get to drink with him, fight by his side, complain about what an ass his little brother is. People loved him. If he said a thing, people believed it. Roderick. He kept this house together through, through sheer force of will. And my brother was a true lord. They'll sing songs about him someday. But you're the lord here now, like it or not, by the laws of your land. And to these men, you've more than proven yourself. I know. If I don't become lord, Roderick's sacrifice, everything we went through, will be for nothing. You'll make Roderick proud. Make your father proud. If only he could see me now. We have to go, my lord. And Lud Whitehill will be on the march. Let's move! 